what you do need to be careful with is make sure your tack strip is good. Oh, your tack strip. See, he's trying not to damage the tack strip as he take it apart. If it does, you definitely got a water saw. Tack strip seem to be in intact on a lot of it. It's pretty good, reusable. He do got a tool for that. He do got a tool for the staples to remove it. Why he's not using it? This is Poncho. He's a real commando. Alright, that's the top. That's the glass. Actually, with the glass back. Pop the staples out around the trim stick. And we on from there. Got everything off. We take the rivets off. We use those. Top, the pads, the glass. We carry that big heavy sucker. We're gonna build in the prep. This is your frame with nothing. So you nothing but the bones. Rebecca. Since we done skipped him, I put a little tack strip in there. So we can catch too. We done skipped him. So we better put some makeup on him and put the top on. Rinsing it off, rinsing it off. A lot of that grime off. We was going to see about getting this thing powder coated. See what we going to use going to work just as good. Powder coat. Had to take all my tack strip off. It's in good shape, so. No, 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 Franco. You're doing it wrong. Mm -hmm. Rinsing all the grime off. We're gonna let this thing dry and paint it up. Make it look back new. About to throw the rack back. Alright, took everything out. Took everything out. Got it right. It's time to go back in. Hey, Toosters. Got the rack back in. Put the new cables in. Gonna lube up them gears. I'm stretching the pads on. Put the new pads on. Look like the bow look pretty good around the front. So I think we good there. Everything back nice and tight. I'm gonna go on in. Start lubing everything back up. Put them pads on. And that's about a wrap on that. I'll be back in a minute.